Take that in. Somebody take that in. The last time we used, we shot it, we shot a full can of pop, unopened can of pop, and it literally disintegrated it. We get a ping pong ball going fast enough that it'll, it'll blow clear through about four pop cans. Right. And so we have a backstop that we use because we don't want to put a hole in the nice one. Right there. These orange ones, we got six orange ones here. That are... what, we have, what the kids have built here is a ping pong ball cannon that uses a vacuum to suck all of the air out of the tube. And then a ping pong ball is placed inside of that tube. And by rupturing the paper on one end of the tube, the ball will accelerate to several hundred miles per hour and you blow through the paper at the other end and go right through a pop can or whatnot. Well, save the and uh, then we're going to be adding compressed air onto it to make it even go faster and we're hoping to get to supersonic speeds. Two, one. Wow. Yeah! Uh, let's turn off the vacuum pump. Please trade them off to the other seat. Oh my god. That thing is crazy fast. Supersonic, we just did 883 miles per hour. Woo! Woo! I'd say probably you might as well just go ahead. Here we go. It's going to go any second now. Here we go, Ron. Yep. Come on, baby. 130. Fabulous. We didn't we didn't expect to spray watermelon uh, twenty some feet back on us, but uh, uh, so we got the boys mopping. But it was great uh, and uh, supersonic right through a watermelon with a ping pong ball. No, guys, you gotta do it like the right way. Oh yeah, you got good idea.